so guys in this video i'm gonna be talking on the mistakes students make um when writing their motivation later so um the first one is this students um feel to talk about themselves instead they go straight to the point yeah you have to be straightforward in your motivation later but at least at the beginning of the letter you have to introduce yourself say a few things about yourself so that they can know where um, the letter is coming from they can know who is writing that letter so that's that for the number one then for the number two um students make uh use of complex words a lot like they make use of complex word like 80 percentage 80 percentage of complex word now i'm not saying you shouldn't make use of complex words yeah complex words can uh, boost up your application because at the same time it also proves that you are uh, proficient in english but at the same time it can end up stressing the persons in charge of the letter because the the supervisors might be forced to look up your words on the dictionary which will take them little time so no one wants to stress his or herself because you are not the only one um writing this letter many people are writing this letter from different parts of the world so they don't want to spend so much time on just one letter so make sure you use simple words i'm not saying you shouldn't make use of complex word but at least your complex word should be 20 percentage then simple english should be 80. do not use complex words in every line make your complex word 20 percentage then three this one 80 percentage of students for victim of this 84 victim of this now here is it now um most students applying for this scholarship are not financially stable like they are coming from poor background sorry for saying this but this is true that is just the fact most students applying are coming from poor backgrounds so what they um um feel that is that if they um talk a little about their family backgrounds that it can give them um advantage over others like okay let me use this for example like someone might say i am coming from a poor family background but if i am awarded this scholarship I will study well and I won't let you down. That is bad. That is very, very bad. Yeah. In some other way, it's kind of good, but I won't advise you to, to include that in, in your letter. You are not meant to, to, to persuade them. You are meant to convince them. Convince them. You are not meant to beg them to offer you this scholarship it is something that once they just read they would give you the scholarship automatically so you are meant to construct your letter in a way that it will convince them so so um this is where so many students make mistake by by um including their family backgrounds in the letter it's not advisable to do that then the last one make sure your letter is simple and short yeah like i said before these um supervisors don't want to waste time on just your letter they don't want to waste time on just one letter so make sure your letter is short make your words easy to read and understand that's it for this video okay guys thanks for your time